navigate to My Organization from the main menu on the left-hand side and down to Overview. Everything entered on this page will be visible on the Play HQ public site and the Cricket Australia Play Cricket site. First, upload your club logo. For best results, follow the instructions on the screen. Next, you can enter a description of your club, including your contact details. You have the option to enter a phone number, email address, and a website if applicable. Select Visible on Discovery Maps to ensure participants can search for your organisation on all public sites. Enter your club address, including latitude and longitude. Your latitude and longitude can be found on Google Maps. Select which formats are offered at your club. These formats are set up by Cricket Australia and will flow through to the Play Cricket website. Next, enter any age and gender-specific information as well as any inclusion categories your club caters for. Last step is to enter your club's terms and conditions. Once you have set up your terms and conditions, you will have the option to add these into any registration form you set up. When participants register, they will be required to agree to your terms and conditions. Any other organisation involved in a registration will also be able to add their terms and conditions, such as your association or your state or national body. You have the option to copy and paste your terms and conditions into a text box, or you can link to your terms and conditions on a web page. Select Update and Save once you have finalised your organisation's overview. Next, you can add in your organisation's contact details. Select Contacts along the top. Click in the text field and enter the details of your contacts, selecting positions from the drop-down list. To add additional contacts, select Add Contact. You can use the eye in the visibility column to determine whether these contacts are visible on public sites. To hide a contact from the public, click the eye icon. The icon will be greyed out with a line through it when a contact is hidden. We encourage all organisations to keep their contacts up to date as administrator roles change from year to year. Organisations have the ability to turn on email notifications for registrations and transfer and permit requests. Select the Notifications tab, enter an email address and select Add. The email address entered will appear below and you can toggle on the notifications you would like to receive. Programs and competitions will trigger an email for every registration to your organisation if toggled on. Transfers and permits will trigger an email for every transfer and permit created, either inbound or outbound, for your organisation. The transfer and permit notifications ensure your organisation is aware of all player movements. When the toggle is green, notifications will be turned on. You can add multiple email addresses and turn notifications on under each of the headings. Select Update and Save to save any changes made. 